Good evening, the, ca the Carrick fan here. So, right, so Manchester United have just lost 2-0 against Man Manchester City at Old Trafford. For me, I, I did expect that result tonight, to be honest. Uh, we, we turned up in the first half. I thought we played really, really, really well. To be honest, R Rashford came close. Um, then Sane came on second half because Fernandinho was injured. Um, then, yeah, then Sane scored a second, which I thought they should have saved, to be honest. But, oh, well, you can't. He, he he can't save everything all the time, and that, for me, he's still the best keeper in the world, Just despite his um, uh, poor season by his by his average standards. Um, so yeah, there won't be a meltdown for me tonight. Um, I did expect that result, like I said. So yeah, Link Link had been missing a sister from five years. I'm not gonna say nothing about him because I, I I don't see the point of um having the meltdown. But on, on another positive, um, or should I say? A positive for, for United. Arsenal lost three one at Wolves. I did expect that. Um, Ars apparently Arsenal were, were crap tonight. Apparently, so yeah, that that that, that is a positive. And and yeah, f fourth place is up for grabs. And I do hope we we get it because we play Chelsea on Sunday. We 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 do have to win that. We we've got to win that on uh, Sunday. If we don't win that, you could forget top four. Although saying that, we do have Huddersfield and Cardiff coming up after that. But for me, um, yeah, it, it will be difficult getting set for now. But there's three games left. But and you never know with regard to the Premier League. It does um, throw up some some surprises regarding the surprise results. So yeah, uh, I'm happy that, that um, Arsenal lost tonight. I did half expect it to be, to be honest. Although I didn't expect them to lose by that amount. By that amount and yeah so yeah quick united um stories for you um united have been linked with thomas Mina. I, I would take that i would take him to be honest um i think he's 26 or 27 or 28 um he, he's a united fan and he, he's a good right back as well so yeah i would take him and, and apparently was in the telegraph today um united are considering um bringing darren fletcher in in some kind of football structure or, or something at the club, I don't know. I don't know what to think of that, to be honest. But uh, yeah, and there was a story going around a couple of days ago on Bank Holiday Monday, and uh, about um, Mike Fielder being dir director of football. I would take that, but I I really don't trust this club regarding transfers and stuff like that, to be honest. But uh, yeah, so I'm a bit dis I am a bit disappointed with the result, but. In, in in a way, it does stop Liverpool from winning the winning the league. I suppose to stop the the canal asses now. <sighs> Dirty me, especially their fan, their fans. They can stop looking at our asses now. But oh well, at least they hopefully won't be winning the league the the season. Fingers crossed. So yeah, but overall, I'm uh, um I am happy with with how we performed in the first half, but not the second. We got outclassed, but. The, 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 there has to be a summer rebuild that the summer in my opinion because like Oli Gunnar Solskjaer said yesterday we will we we can forget the league next next season if we don't um get get um cleared of the crap players like Young and Darmian although Darmian did have a good game that tonight that that was his first game with Oli Gunnar Solskjaer as well so yeah I'm gonna watch it a AFTV in, in in a bit hopefully DT will be ranting. <laughs> not bad I, I am pleased that's a loss for, for, for that reason only but yeah um re regarding tonight's result I said on Sunday I did I want this, this to roll over I was saying that in the, in the heat, heat of the moment and um over, over, over the last couple of days I, I have been thinking 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 uh, and I did say this to, to a United friend of mine um today Liverpool are going to win the league uh, eventually and with and yeah, I said that Liverpool are gonna win the league eventually, whether it's this season or, or next season. Hopefully not not this not this season. We've done a done a favour to Man City and the football they will. And um, so yeah, but for me the the most satisfying thing for me tonight is just stopping Liverpool winning the winning the league. If if we've if we've stopped Liverpool from winning the league by by losing, who cares? All all I all, all I all I'll say to Liverpool fans is. Liverpool fans is 
Gerard back pass versus Chelsea in 2010. That is all. Right, you can see. Oh, my man, match contenders are. <sighs> Who played all tonight? For Darmian had a good game. Yeah, Young was okay. Young was okay in the first half, but he was crap. Um, Rashford had a good first half. I thought Shaw had a good game. Fred. Um, <laughs> excuse me, Fred. I thought he had the okay game as well. Pereira. <coughs> Likewise, so yeah. But that Chelsea game, lose that. We we can say goodbye to top four. Although, I, I do agree with, with the opinion that if we don't get top four, the club will shit, some, shit themselves and I'll be thinking, oh God, no top four. We, we, we've we got to spend a lot of money like, 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 like we have done over the last couple of years when we've not done top four. So yeah, right, you can see me at, at Carrick United. Subscribe, subscribe to my channel, channel the Carrick Fan. Comment below. And I will be back on Twitter on Friday. Fingers crossed. Just keep the faith, people. Be patient. I will be back doing videos on Twitter. Adios.